The third type of profit maximizer is the slack adjuster. I love slack adjusters because they can really have a dramatic impact on the bottom line because the idea with the slack adjuster is that it's typically 10x to 100x the core offer price. So this is really where you go out there and you just shoot for the stars. This is where you know you go out there and, and you make your, your really, really big, gigantic offer. Now, it's only going to appeal to about 2% of your market, but that's okay. These 2%, they want to buy, they want to ascend, they want to, to, to ask like, okay, what's the most expensive thing that you have? Okay, great, I'll take that, right? So, and in most markets, if you look, they have these. There's some type of slack adjuster and oftentimes it's sold as access. It's sold as access or some type of done for you, but not always. The reason that you can see, um, this is a, a picture from Starbucks kind of in the background here is that Starbucks has a classic example of a slack adjuster. If you walk into a Starbucks, you can buy a three, four, five dollar cup of coffee, but you can also buy a three, four, five thousand dollar espresso machine in many Starbucks, right? Now, when people walk into the Starbucks, most of them are just there for a three, four, five dollar cup of coffee. Uh, do many of them go in there and, and leave with a incredibly high priced espresso machine? No. Do even two percent of them? Maybe not. But when it's that much more expensive than the core offering, you don't need a lot to make a really, really, really uh, big difference on the profit and on the bottom line. Because again, the cost of acquisition has already been incurred. So think, what's something that's very high ticket that might only appeal to the top 2%? Right. Remember, you've heard probably of the 80-20 rule, right? Where you know 20, 80 uh, percent of your revenue is coming from from 20 percent of of the population of, of your customer base. Well, what people don't realize is that 80-20 is fractal. So you've got 80-20, and then within the 20, there's another 80-20, and within that 20, there's another 80-20, and that's where you get down to this magic two percent of your market who will who will spend. 10x to 100x what an ordinary customer is willing to spend as long as you make that offer to them. So what type of access can you give them? What type of service can you do for them? Um, what is your three, four, five thousand dollar cappuccino machine? Now is the time to be bold, all right? Don't be scared, don't think that, um, oh, but this isn't gonna appeal to everyone. It doesn't have to. Um, in addition to these being uh, really great for profit margin. They're also great for brand elevation, right? So um, when you go out there and, and, and you offer something that is truly that expensive, that makes people think, wow, this is a premium player. This is a luxury uh, brand, even if you don't think about yourself that way. So don't be shy, be bold, and think, what are some slack adjusters that you could be offering to your market?